and this is my review of the size X extender. I bought it about five months ago and I thought it was about time I put out this review to let you know what I think about it. I'm going to tell you about the good points and the bad points and show you my results as well and if I think it's really worth getting one or not. Um, and I guess the bottom line is you want to know if it actually works, um, if it's going to give you a bigger size, is it permanent. So I'm going to cover all of that stuff in this video. Uh, make sure you watch the whole thing, so I'm going to show you the extender and how it works, and I'm going to tell you where I got mine at a good discount price as well. So, uh, let's get started. Now, if you're like me, you're probably thinking, is this extender a scam? And it's a good question. I definitely wasn't sure about this product, because there are a lot of enlargement products out there that are definitely scams, there's no doubt about that. And the reason I know is because I've actually spent money and bought some of them, and uh, it was just rubbish. You might have seen adverts like this one on the internet. I mean, look at it. Learn how to grow your cock four inches in four weeks. It really is ridiculous. Just don't waste your money on crap like that because, I mean, if it was actually possible, every guy out there would have a ten inch dick in four weeks from now. So it's just crap. So you should avoid it. As for the size genetics extender, it, in my personal experience, it's definitely not a scam. Um, I've managed to get some pretty good results using it. I wouldn't say I've grown really fast but I've had a realistic and steady rate of growth using it. I will just show you this as well. The size genetics extender actually has a type 1 medical device certificate. Um, this is something that's given out by the FDA, that's the Food and Drug Administration, to say that it's been clinically tested and officially recognized as being effective uh, to increase penis size. So you, you can actually see the page here on the FDA's site um, about device classification. I've just highlighted there that's what the size genetics extender has a class 1 certificate. Products don't get these unless they've been tested and proven to genuinely work and I looked into that before I bought mine and in Europe as well the size genetics extender does have a CE stamp which means it's been tested and uh, is safe to use. And one other thing I'll show you as well is that the extender is backed and endorsed by medical doctors I mean, you can see a couple of them here, plastic surgeons, um, clinical psychologists, and there's some others here. And because I'm quite careful when it comes to spending money, I did look into the guarantee. And it's a 100% money back guarantee if you don't get any results within six months. So you've got a full six months to actually use the extender, uh, see what results you get. And if you genuinely don't get any results, they'll give you all of your money back. So it's really the guarantee and the other stuff I've just mentioned that convinced me to give it a try. And overall I'm very happy I did, because the results I've gotten so far have been pretty good. So I'd say if you're worrying about it being a rip-off, about it being a scam, um, it really isn't. So um, hopefully this has put your mind at rest about that anyway. Okay, so now I'm just going to show you everything that you actually get with the size genetics when you order. Um, obviously you get the, the case, um, this contains all the bits and pieces, the rods, the extras. And it does actually come with a key as well, so you can actually shut the case and lock it and keep it all secure so no one knows what's in there. Um, then you get the actual extender itself, you get the base unit, um, which is solid plastic, it's really well made. Um, you get all these different rods, and you get the headpiece as well, which you fit on the top, and you can use either the strap uh, to fix it on, or you can use the noose. And you also get the different uh, comfort attachments like the foam ring, you get these stretchy elastic fittings, there's a, a black plastic um, belt as well there keeping that plastic uh, covering. Um, you get a few of these different metal rods, these are so you can actually extend it when you need, um, need to stretch it longer. Um, it comes with some um, included, I actually got six of the two inch ones. Um, two of the one inch rods and in the box as well you get two of these half inch rods so you can combine those how you need them um, you get the DVD and that uh, shows you how to use it, how to fit all the comfort options um, you get the traction powder to help get a good grip uh, when you're fitting it, you get the Revita cream moisturizing lotion just to help keep your uh, penis in good condition and you get the device wipes just to keep the actual size genetics um, extender in good condition as well yeah that's pretty much everything you get when you order it okay in this video I'm just gonna quickly show you how you actually use the extender 
Unfortunately, I've only got this carrot to demonstrate on, but it'll have to do. All you do is get the base piece, and you attach however many rods you need to get the desired length. They just screw into place. Then it's simply just a case of sliding the base piece down yourself while you're flaccid like that. And then you want to get the headpiece. Um, here I've just got the standard rubber strap fitted, but you can either use uh, the noose, the rubber noose here, or um, a combination of the comfort options as well, like the foam ring and uh, you know these rubber bands here and the black strap there whatever you find comfortable um, but for this demo we'll just use uh, the standard strap all you do is slide it over the head of your penis and uh, onto the metal rods of the extender like that and then you just secure it in place by pulling it tight there and then you just want to twist the, the rods to get the desired traction on it and it basically just stretches you out that way like that and if you do that day in day out um, you know it stretches you little by little and uh, as the weeks go by you keep adding a little bit more traction it keeps pulling you further and then when you need to you add another rod like the half inch rod or the one inch rod um, and just keep growing and growing and growing as you go along um, to take it off it's pretty easy you just unloosen the, um, the strap and that headpiece just slides off and then you slide the base piece off like that. Um, I mean they say you should wear it a few hours a day. I've found wearing it four or five hours works for me. Um, I usually try and wear it at night when I'm at home but I've been able to set up the ex extender and wear it under my clothes during the day too. I generally point it upwards and position it under the top of my pants. It's not ideal but I can't sit around at home all day and wearing it because I've got stuff to do. But the main thing is you can wear it under your clothes if you need to and no one will know about it. Or if you do have the time to sit at home in your bathroom, or sorry, your bathrobe, um, you can do that, or do what I do and uh, and just wear it at night. So here I'm going to show you my results using it so far, and this is the spreadsheet I keep of my progress week by week. It really just helps me keep track of how I'm doing, and it's a good idea to keep a log like this because it helps you keep motivated, um, see the progress that you're making, and really just shows my erect length measurement um, week by week and obviously any notes that I've added there I've been using the extender nearly every day for about five and a half months my penis is definitely bigger it, it hangs much lower and it's soft and like you can see on the spreadsheet I started at 6.3 inches and at 22 weeks I'm now at 7.2 inches so I've gained just under an inch in length after about five and a half months it's been a steady realistic rate of growth I'd say it's kinda like weight training you aren't gonna get huge muscles overnight you do need to put in a little effort over a period of time to get some gains and see some changes in size but it's been great to actually look at myself and see my bigger size it's definitely made me feel a lot more confident in the bedroom and a lot less self-conscious I mean before I never really used to let a girl get a good look at me naked but now I'm a lot happier you know to get naked when I'm with my girlfriend and let her have a good look it's just made me a lot happier and I'm you know a lot happy with the current size that I've got right now so yeah those are the results I've been having and um, hopefully it's gonna continue so now I'm just gonna mention a couple of things that I actually don't like about the extender um, the first thing is that sometimes it can be a little awkward to wear it under your clothes and I can wear it under my clothes without anyone knowing about it, that's not actually the problem. Um, but sometimes I just need to adjust it, like adjust the tension or move it slightly so it's a bit more comfortable. And it's not always easy to do if you're out or if you're at work and there are lots of other people around. Um, but I mean if you want results you do have to wear it so I guess if you can go to the restroom and adjust it or do what I do and, and just wear it at night as much as possible. Um, another thing that can be a little annoying is if I've been wearing it for two or three hours or more sometimes I'll need to take the headpiece off and reattach it after a minute or two just to give myself a break um, and that's because it it can sort of lessen the blood fo flow a little bit to the end of the penis it's not really bad it's not like it totally cuts off the circulation or anything but it can start to feel a bit tingly and you'll just need to give it a break for a minute and then just reattach it um, and another thing is that it can take a little while to get used to using the extender. Um, it's kind of like learning to drive a car. You need to take a few lessons before you get the hang of it. 
and it's the same with this if you use it every day for a week or so you'll start to get more comfortable with it but you do have to experiment around with it um, a bit at the beginning to learn how to get the best out of it um, but once you've you've mastered it and you're up to speed it's um, it is really easy to use so it's just a couple of points there nothing too bad but um, worth mentioning so having said all of that I'm just gonna mention some of the things I do like about the extender now and the first thing is that the mechanism for increasing the the traction um, is really accurate and I like the system with the different size rods as well um, so you can get just the right length um, that you need just to help you grow that little bit extra and obviously you can just increase it and it's really well made it's very precise and you can get just the right amount of tension on it um, it's really solid really well made built to last so yeah I think that's something that you know is important in a device like this it's really good I also like all the different options you have for strapping yourself in like the foam ring uh, these little rubber rings you can use the noose if you want or the the standard strap and the headpiece you can use a combination of any of these whatever you find comfortable and it's important because if you're going to be wearing it a few hours every day it needs to be comfortable and um, that's something a lot of extenders like this don't have um, so I like that about this one it is pretty simple to use as well once you get the hang of it um, like I said after your first week or so once you've got to grips with it it's pretty easy to set up it takes me a, just a couple of minutes now um, it's not really all that fiddly it's easy to put on um, and easy to take off um, and probably the biggest thing that I like about it is that it actually works I mean if you wear it consistently increase the tension bit by bit it really can permanently increase the size I mean it's not magic though you have to put in the effort and time with it but it's it's totally worth it and it, it can get you bigger permanently um, and I suppose the last thing is that it's easy to look after there's not much you can really break on it it's all pretty solid and as long as you keep it in the the box and keep it locked and secure um, you know it's gonna last you a long long time so those are just some of the things that I um, I really do like about this one anyway one other thing that I did just want to quickly mention as well is that when I ordered the extender uh, it just came in a plain brown box like this I and mean, there's nothing on it to say what it is it's just got your name and address on it um, mine came in about two or three days from me ordering it so it's pretty quick and from what I understand they do deliver to most countries around the world as well um, another thing I did was check my credit card statement and there's nothing on that that says exactly what it is I bought so it is totally discreet and private um, so if you're worried about that you you don't need to be because they do a really good job of um, of keeping it all secret so just something I wanted to point out okay I'll just do a quick summary here now before I bought it I'd read that this was quite a popular product and overall I'd say I'm I'm quite happy that I decided to get it. Of all the enlargement stuff I've tried, this has definitely given me the best results. Like I said earlier, I'm a lot more confident in the bedroom. I feel a lot happier with the size that I've got now, and it does actually kind of feel like I'm filling up my girlfriend a lot more too, and she's really been enjoying it. I guess I just generally feel a lot happier about myself too, but as I've said, the extender is a proper medical grade device, so it's built to last, it's clinically tested, and once you get the hang of it, it is pretty easy to use. It's endorsed by medical professionals as well. And uh, yeah, I'm just going to keep going with it until I reach my size goal. But overall, I would give it four and a half out of five stars. It isn't perfect, but if you stick with it and you actually put in the time and put in the effort, it really.